Leos. Jeez. Oh, I'm so hot. Okay, let's do my Leos. My Leos in love for the beginning. It's the symbol or whatever. Okay. This may or may not resonate. Okay. Take what does, leave what does not. Um, please like, share, and subscribe. Comment below. Let me know what you think. Okay. Or if you don't like it, you can dislike it. It's okay. Um, again, subscribe. But um, we're going to get into this overall energy of Leo in love for the beginning of September. Please excuse me because it's really hot outside. See, I was trying to do this whole like nature thing. Like, oh, let's get outside and connect with the sun. And, you know, but let me tell you, it's hot. It's hot outside. Hello, how you doing? Okay, so let's get into this Leo. Leo's energy from the beginning of September in love. Leo, so we're gonna spare, please, any clear, concise messages, please. For my Leo's in love. Both of those honesty, like I need to be honest with yourselves, be real with yourself, like be real with um, hold on, um, I feel like I feel like. Leo's in love for September. Please, Spirit, give me clear, precise messages. And please let it, let me understand, let them understand, let it resonate. Da -da. Okay, so. I feel like Leo's. I feel like. I feel like Lali y'all y'all in a relationship. I feel like y'all, it's like um y'all putting in like you feel this way, but they feel the other way, and you know that. So it's like oh you're doing all the work, or like oh babe let's talk about it. Da -da -da -da. But they don't care. You know they don't care, but you really care. Their actions say one thing. They word they mouth say one thing. They actions say another. They can be saying, oh, babe, I love you so much. Oh, yeah, I want to be with you. I want to be with you. I want to have a baby. Oh, let's live happily ever after. They can be saying this all the time. But you know deep down in your heart that it's not giving it. Okay? So, and one day they might be giving you, like, lover's vibes. Let's clarify the lover. It's lover's in reverse. So, I'll clarify the two of cups. So, they can be, like I said, they can be saying this. They want this, but it's really this. And you know it. You're not being honest with yourself because you're trying to hold on to something that's not real. Trust. Trust transformation occurs through acceptance. You need to accept what it is and move on. You get what I'm saying? You need to understand that losing something is an opportunity to grow from it and appreciate the lesson that you learn from it because you need to walk away from the situation. You know you need to walk away from the situation. You know it's not what they say it is. Like, I really feel like it's them being like, oh, yeah. Like, when y'all, I feel like when y'all making love or um, to by yourself, whoever this is. I feel like, all right, when y'all by yourself, they so in love with you, oh, this and the third. But when y'all get around other people or in other environments or around a certain person, they're switching it up, acting a certain type of way, okay? So, if a person is not consistent, hey, how are you doing? So I feel like if if a person not consistent, so and they they when when y'all home by yourself, they all acting like oh I love you babe, da -da -da -da, or they all cuddling and stuff like that. But when y'all get around their family and friends or whoever, or e even just in public, they're a whole different person. So they're not that's not really who they are. They're faking, okay. Or when y'all having sex or whatever, they like oh yeah let's make a baby, let's have a family, whatever, let's build. They don't want to build with you. This is the opposite of building. They do not want to build. 
Um, like I said, you need to be honest with yourself about it because you know what it is. And it's not given what they say it is given. They're lying. You know they're a liar. Yeah. And you need to get in, touch, in tune, back in touch with yourself because you're losing yourself in this process. Trying to force something that's not meant to be. So, I'm going to do Virgo next because I felt to do Virgo next. I was going to do it anyway. So, I'm going to do Virgo. But, yes. So, I would say, here it says, move forward. You know what you're supposed to do. Let it go. Let go and let God. And they're going to take care of it. But if you're, what do you need to release? Them. You know. It's not love. It's not. Be honest with yourself. Okay? Because they be honest with you. They not being honest with you, but they show you what it really is. And you're ignoring it. So don't ignore it. And when a person shows you who they are, believe them, honey. Okay? So, like I said, this may or may not resonate. This may be something that's happening now. Or it's about to happen. Or it's already happened. Let me know if it resonated. Hit a thumbs up. Or thumbs down. Whatever. But subscribe to my channel. Period. Uh, next, we're going to get into Virgo's energy. Um, and I thank y'all for your love and support.